Alright, let's go ahead and make a DIY fry tank. Alright guys, welcome back. I'm going to go ahead and take some scrap parts that I have left over from some previous builds and just the aquarium hobby in general and build a nano fry tank. We got some egg crate, got some plexiglass. Um, this is going to be a 20 gallon long. I'm going to pretty much try to do it as an all in one, save some space and see what I can get made out of this. Let's go. But first things first, gotta clean up from the previous build. All right, so I cleaned up the work area. We're gonna go ahead and get ready to paint the back panel and the bottom. Um, gonna go ahead and use the Rust Oleum Painter's Touch Premium Latex and put on a couple coats here. So. I'm going to get this started. All right, so the latex stuff, that didn't work out. I wasn't drying too well, and as it was going on, even with the roller, it looked like a bubble factory. So I'm going to go ahead and scrape all this off. Find me a spray can here with some uh, rust oleum and use that instead. Uh, I was just trying this out just to see how it worked. Had a can for latex uh, paint laying around, so I said, let me give it a shot. I was that did not work. I just went to my first instant and just sprayed the whole thing. So I'm going to go ahead and finish clearing this up and grab a spray can. Alright, so after going through the box of aquarium stuff and sort of through all the pumps and everything that I have, I am going to go with this MJ1200. Uh, see if I can go in and get some good flow out of this. If not, then I can always bump it up. I got other pumps in here um, that I can go in and use, but for the time being, I think I'll just plumb it with that. If that doesn't work out, then I'm just going to switch it up. Alright, so what I'm going to do for the all in one, we're going to have water coming through this chamber here. Um, thinking of doing like a filtration plate, still working on that. It's going to go under and then over into the pump section here come back out and we're good to go. Uh, so it's a simple three chamber setup. 
Um, right now I got a bunch of biomedia getting seeded up. Um, so that should be ready to go here in about the next couple of days or so. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and cut out a notch here. That way I can get the water to flow over, down, probably do a uh, sponge, the filter media, uh, probably a heater in this chamber, who knows, um, and then the pump to go back out. So I'm just going to keep it versatile, one, two, three, done. So I'm just going to go ahead, right now nothing's glued down, um, I just cut out these pieces here and like I said I had a bunch of scrap acrylic laying around. So everything's movable so far but for the most part it is going to be three chamber under over. Alright, we're going to put these down and I'll glue everything down and I'll come back. All right, so here is the all-in-one piece that I have the water flow over, under, back over, and then back out. Uh, give me one sec, let me go ahead and grab the water pump and show you how it looks hooked up that way all right so here's the maxi jet 1200 um, found a couple little parts I had for one of the um, media reactors here so I got a little ball valve on it use the, uh, the nozzle that comes with the return on it and I'm just going to have it sitting in here like this. Um, like I said, just testing it out. If it doesn't work, I can always change it up. Put an actual lock line on the end of it here and, you know, do it up. But I just wanted to go ahead and use the parts that I did have already to get this build done. And... Everybody's going to say, why is it clear? Because that's what I had left for acrylic. So here's the final results, guys. Frag tank's up. It's running. Actually, it's been up for two weeks now. Had to let a lot of things settle out. New tank water. Uh, had a bit of cloudiness happening. Um, like an outcome of it. Up to flow, added a j RW4 powerhead. Uh, to get more flow in the tank. Other than that, just enjoying it. Moved all my frags over. Had it added new frags. So, again, like, comment, subscribe, and have a great day.